Now that you know how to save a PowerPoint presentation as a PDF file, you probably notice that every slide has its own page, so there's one slide per page. Now what you're going to do to save handouts or you know to save a PDF so that you can hand them out is rather than having one slide per page, you're going to save it so that you might have uh, six slides per page or whatever you want. And this is how you do it. You go into your Save As, you save it to wherever you want to save it. And then you take your, uh, you choose your correct file type extension, or the Save As Type, and then you go to Options. So let's go to Options, and as a default, it's slides, and they're all the slides. We're going to go Handouts. We can put frames around the slides, which would be, you know, a square around each slide so that it's a little more visible or defined. And you can go from one to nine per page. So since this slideshow is actually pretty short, let's go with uh, let's go with six. And you can go with horizontal or vertical order. See how that works. Uh, we won't talk about hidden slides or anything like that. Basically, there's nothing else we need to talk about here. Just click OK. I'm going to call this one. Uh, handouts. So in your case, make sure that the word handouts appears in your file name as opposed to the other file names that you used. We'll click on save and let's see what this thing looks like. And here we go. So if you were to print this off, you'd see six pages or six slides per page. So if we had, you know, 24 slides, uh, you'd have how many pages? Four. So so, of course, this last one shows up here. Um, and that's about it. That's all there is to it.